Hello my soccer universe and to the first of two videos that I'm gonna post uh, today because we have already on Friday matches starting again and this is the big weekend where many leagues all around Europe are opening up but not necessarily the big ones. We have of course the Bundesliga, we have the Danish league opening up, we have Ukraine with uh, Dynamo against Schachter opening up. We have the Czech League opening up, we have the Serbian League opening up, so uh, lots of stuff. However, after a lot of deliberation, uh, since I'm now making the graphics myself and you know where is, and also thinking where is really my interest, I made the really, really tough call and this was not an easy decision. To only focus now on the, let's say, top six six seven leagues in Europe maybe eight let's add the Netherlands in plus Austria something like that I need to limit it I cannot cover everything it will definitely be the big four and you know France and the others are, are, are playing at the moment so uh, that will not bother me honestly too much at the moment and there will always be Austria in there now in this video we're gonna talk everything from Friday going to Monday which basically is an entire Bundesliga round and as I said I'm only gonna talk about Germany and what's happening in Austria this weekend um, and as La Liga and so on come back I will add those in. Let's start in the Bundesliga. I have to say after the midweek round which was kind of so and so um, with great games in there and then some you know very much relegation uh, battles this one seems like Always a top team against a lesser team. I mean, it starts on fr uh, Friday evening in Freiburg against Leverkusen. Then we have Wolfsburg, Frankfurt on Saturday, Hertha Augsburg and Mainz Hoffenheim. Uh, and Schalke Bremen. So there are four games in the afternoon. Schalke Bremen, probably the, one, the biggest name game. Pretty huge game because uh, Bremen really needs to pick up points and Schalke is in a horrible form. So that might be the pick of the weekend to, to be honest. There's of course Bayern against Düsseldorf, the late game, which yeah, Düsseldorf has been pesky and so on, but I don't see anything but Bayern winning here. Gladbach Union also should be an easy win for Gladbach. Uh, Paderborn Dortmund, this was a 3-3 in Dortmund. So I'm curious to see how uh, Dortmund can bounce back. And the Monday evening could be an interesting one. I'm afraid it's not Köln against Leipzig. Uh, Leipzig is a so-and-so team, but you know, uh, away from home, they were good. Second Bundesliga, uh, yeah, after all the big matchups, I have to say, Holstein Kiel, Bielefeld could be a big one. Uh, Dynamo Dresden gets back, playing against Stuttgart and HSV is looking at a must win against Wiesbaden. And let's see the fourth one, Heidenheim against Aue is also kind of a thing that uh, a game that must be won and then let's move to Austria we start on Friday evening with the cup final so you see everything from quarter final down it's kind of a non starter because the final was already in the semi-final between Salzburg and Lusk so it's now Salzburg against Lustenau uh, should have happened on the 1st of May now it's on 29th of May honestly uh, anything but a clear victory by Salzburg would be a surprise here. So those are the games that are on my scope for now. There will be a what to watch probably already Monday or Tuesday morning because there's more coming uh, mid midweek. Anyway, let me know what you'll be watching. I have to say this weekend it leaves me rather cold to be honest. I mean Schalke Bremen excites me because of the names but everything else is kind of so wow 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 wow. So let's see. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos like this and I'll talk to you soon. Bye. Hey there. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, here are some videos and playlists that would be of interest to you too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel as it will keep you updated with all things that are rotating in my soccer universe. With that, I wish you a wonderful day. Bye!